Giving Hearts Day is a one-day giving event for people to show love to charities. And joining us today is Amanda Godfrey from Make-A-Wish, North Dakota. Amanda, always a pleasure to have you. Thank you guys for having and me, having me and happy <laughs> almost Giving Hearts Day. <laughs> yeah, I mean, this is a big day. Yes. Tell us about Giving Hearts Day as related to Make-A-Wish, North Dakota. So we are one of uh, nearly 570 charities that are participating in Giving Hearts Day, which, like you said, is a one-day giving opportunity. Um, in this one day, we just invite anybody, you could be live anywhere in the world and participate in this. Um, we ask you to make a donation, a minimum of $10 to support our cause, to support any one of the other causes involved. Our goal on that one day is to raise $100,000, which wow. is a huge, huge lofty goal, but we were really close last year. We feel like we can get over that hump this year. Um, and for an organization of our size, that, I mean, that's game-changing money for us. Um, and so we're just really, really excited for it all to, to happen on Thursday. Yeah. And, and your theme is small towns, big hearts. Yes. Uh, what can you tell us about that? Yes. So we have about 40 uh, wish ambassadors, if you will, all across the state from 28 different towns. And um, we just really feel like North Dakota, that's, that's the symbol of North Dakota, right? We're a bunch of small towns which, with a bunch of people who have very big hearts. And so we wanted to lean into that theme and just those those people are going out in their communities and sharing the impact of Make-A-Wish that it's had on their lives, whether they're directly or indirectly impacted by it, and the opportunity that Giving Hearts Day presents for, for those other folks to raise their hand and get involved. How do you become a volunteer or an ambassador if you're watching this right now and thinking, hey, I, I would love to get involved in that? Awesome. Well, you can visit our website, which is wish.org slash North Dakota, or find us on any social media platform. We're on all of them. And just send us a little note. We will happily reply back right away. Um, you know, Make-A-Wish is a pretty largely known brand, I think, nationally, but many people don't realize we... You know, our group here in North Dakota, we're a very small nonprofit here in North Dakota. Um, and so we will personally reach back out to you with a phone call or an email, whatever way you reached out to us, and we'll connect you right away. And it's so great because we have volunteers all across the state. So you probably know somebody in your mm -hmm. own community already volunteering and we can connect you with them and sort of help get the community growing even bigger. Well, we have to talk about TJ. Mm -hmm. Yes. Um, it, 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 he's a featured he's, wish kid. He right? is. So he's the face of our Giving Hearts Day campaign. There he is. He's so sweet. Um, he is a little boy that lives in Emerado, North Dakota, so on the eastern side of the state, and he has been fighting cancer. Uh, TJ's wish is actually to be an astronaut. Mm -hmm. So how exciting is that? And we are kind of secretly working with NASA to put <gasps> something very, very fun together for Mr. <gasps> TJ, so I can't wait for that to happen and we can share how it all goes once it, once it does happen, but um, he's, he's just such a bright and brilliant little boy that, you know, loves all things space and we're glad to be able to give him that, um, that ray of hope through his cancer journey to be able to say, look, buddy, you know, you have this dream that's totally outside of your, of your health journey and you can focus on that. Let's focus on that rather than having to deal with all the other yucky stuff. Yeah, that's so cool. TJ and Jeff Bezos. Um, <laughs> hey, so again, it, everything's going on throughout the state. What day is uh, Giving Hearts Day? And, and one more time, how can we get in on giving specifically to Maple Yes, Shore's so Coke? Giving Hearts Day is this Thursday, February 8th. Um, it opens up at midnight, from midnight to midnight. So all 24 hours, you can make a gift by going to givingheartsday.org and then you select which charity or charities you want to give to. Make-A-Wish North Dakota is one of those. And the only requirement is a donation of a minimum $10. Now, I will say every charity has a match. Our match, we have it. We have $13,500 that have been graciously donated to match every gift up to that amount. Um, and Williston Basin API, Flint Group, and Roger and Arlene Ryerson were the generous people that did that. So we're really excited to be able to kind of have that be our launch into the day and and, and see if we can hit that $100,000 mark. Oh, that's fantastic. <laughs> can people donate now if they yes, don't want to wait till Thursday? Yes, you absolutely yeah. can. If you think, oh, I'm going to forget or I'm, I'm going to be out of town, um, you can schedule your gift today. So gifts can be scheduled all the way up until the 7th, and then the actual day, February 8th, is, is the big push. Love it. Oh, it's fantastic. Thank you, yes. Amanda, for being with us. And if you want to donate for Giving Hearts Day, head to givingheartsday.org right now. And for more information on Make-A-Wish North Dakota, you can also go to wish.org slash North Dakota. All right.